good early morning. We're so glad you're here. Look at this pup. We daily vlog, so if you enjoyed this video, make sure you come back every day. Decided to get up and be active early this morning because it's the first business day of the month, which means work is going to be monotonous and never ending today. So I decided to do my hair and feel fresh today. Go on a walk and didn't get very far before this happens. But she knows that she's got me wrapped around her finger, so we'll sit here for like a little minute, a little bit before we get going. Hello vlog, it's me, Sarah. Um, we are taking it easy again today. I actually, I just posted on social media that there wouldn't be a vlog today. We started the vlog yesterday. I can put a little bit of it in here. Good, good, good afternoon. We're so glad you're here. Why is, what? why is it so hot over here? Because the oven is, or the stove top is on. We're so glad you're here. We daily vlog, so if you like this video, come back tomorrow. Sarah's sore. Yeah, I'm feeling worse today than I did yesterday. So I did try one of the muscle relaxers. Nice. Hasn't really done anything yet. So we're gonna stay home. Yeah, relaxing at home. I'm gonna think I'm gonna hang some stuff, organize some stuff, eat we're some do stuff. Some online shopping. E shopping is what the hip kids call it. <laughs> but it's gonna be a good day. We're cooking up some tiny little bow ties. I think they're so cute. Okay, this was an unexpected treat from the the baby shower, but the theme of the baby shower is based off of. Do you know what the book is called? To the moon and back for you. To the moon and back for you. Words by Emilia Sirhand, art by E. G. Keller. Keller. Really good book. Um, they went through IVF, and it kind of just like explains. They don't use the word IVF. They just talk about like all of in like a very child friendly like context of like that we went to the moon and back for our babies. Yeah, and everything. And also everything that you did to get here, but also all of the other people along the way. It doesn't even mean you had to go through IVF, but just like the support from family from and family, friends. family, friends, and doctors, nurses, cousins, yeah. co-workers, everybody. Yeah. It's a journey. Yeah. So my mom had bought the book and had a couple of the pages framed for like decoration and she gave them to us after the... Um, after I, the, what is it called? Shower. Shower. I never thought like that would look like that, and I love it. Yeah. It's like another pop of like color that kind of goes with the chair mm -hmm. and the mobile, but so our vibe. Yeah. You know, we got a rep sugar boo, and that's been there for a while, but then we hung those right below it. So it's the last page is right there where it's, I went to the moon and back for you, and it's got like doctors and friends and nurses and family members and aunts, uncles, relatives, grandparents, everybody. 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 Do you want to hang up the stuff in the living room that we've been wanting to too? In the corner? Oh, I gotta think of... Orientation? Wow, yeah. If you think about that, give it like five, let it marinate for five minutes. Yeah, I we'll think the see. pasta's done. Okay. Here's our quick little jardinier red sauce dinner topped with my cashew parm, which I'm running out of. Um, yeah, super simple. But then I fell asleep on the couch at like seven. I did end up taking the muscle relaxer that they gave me, the pregnancy safe one. Um, honestly, I never felt my muscles relax from it, but I did feel the drowsiness from it. I thought I might have just been sleepy, like relaxing on the couch, but I slept a solid, like over 12 hours for sure. Um, more than 12 hours, but I'm feeling better today, still sore. Um, but definitely better and like just overall movement, like getting off the couches and as like intense and whatnot. Peter's right here. Hi. Hi. You just working away? First of the month doozies? Yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah. it's going well. I don't jinx it because it's only 120 and I have the, I'm like halfway, I have two huge things I do on the first of the month and I'm like halfway through the, f one of them waiting for the ETL team. I, it's IT stuff. 
um, to do their part and I can finish one and then I can go do my last piece. So I'm actually like on pace to finish earlier than I usually finish my Yay. stuff on the first of the month. Um, so fingers crossed. Then we gotta figure out what we're gonna do today. If we're just gonna relax, if we're gonna go sleep, if we're gonna go lay in the grass. I Man, we've just been taking it easy. When I don't have to edit, and I'm kind of in between moments in my other jobs. But it was it was good. It's good for you to relax. Yeah. Just, just and just like. And I haven't been scrolling. Like yeah, I've just, just been, been watching. Yeah. Um, I did find a Hello Studios Park Pass, but we'll see how that goes. Yeah. But at I took some Tylenol. Um, we'll see how I feel. Yeah. All right. Work day. <laughs> Nick Miller screaming Nick Miller. in the background. <laughs> He's screaming, I need boundaries in the background. <laughs> um, we're not going to Hollywood Studios. Sarah hates Disney's Hollywood Studios. Just kidding. She needs a rest. <laughs> <laughs> I was like truly thinking about it, but we might have some weekend plans, and I'd rather not overdo it now. Just because I am feeling better today than I was yesterday. Yeah, and by weekend plans, we 100% will have weekend plans. A lot of them, we just don't know in what order yeah. or which ones. My buddy Steve, I have to text him later, so I'm putting it on tape now. This isn't a tape anymore. I'm putting it on an SD card now that I have to text him because I've been meaning to text him for a few days now, so <laughs> i got to go to Publix because I think we're having a lazy, exciting, fun dinner. Hopefully. Fingers crossed. Yeah. Funny, Tuesday, somebody have to comment that Publix is having plant-based deals until Tuesday. Oh. And we're deciding to go to Publix on Tuesday. Maybe it still counts. Maybe or maybe it doesn't, and we're just jamokes. We'll see. The baby was moving around like crazy today. Like, I could see it in my peripheral That's what vision. he was doing. And then when I get back from Publix, we're going to hang something right there. Maybe buy some stuff with our gift cards. Oh, online shopping for the babes all right Publix I'm coming in for five things it's 543 let's see how fast we can do this sucker for the deals sucker for the deals we need that bread like uh, can't have corn dogs without ketchup must have ketchup okay Okay, I found it, but there's BOGO deals still, but this is only one left of the little corn dogs for field roast. But it's a BOGO, but there's not another chance to do the BOGO. All right, after a lengthy conversation with Sarah, um, we figured out what we're getting. Getting the mini hot dogs and some breaded chicken. And of course there's a Pepsi deal, I think. So I think I have to get Pepsi, so maybe not. Um, that was so funny. Peter did get some corn dogs for tonight, but I am zhuzhing up some leftovers. First, I'm frying up rice with the last of our jardinier. And then I'm gonna throw the curry lentil veggie concoction in with it. All right, check that out. That looks like a good vista right there. That it's good to be home. George lassos the moon and one of our embryos. Our sweet, sweet and baby. Corn dogs and fried rice are a sensible combination, right? Look at all that ketchup. I'm usually a dipping station person, but I feel very loyal to ketchup ah! these days. And she's mad because she can't have any. Ooh. Oh, gosh. They got freaking skill. <laughs> Does anybody know what that's from? So we just watched. We finished. Indiana Jones, Indiana Jones and the Devil's Snare, Indiana Jones and the <laughs> Fair Blood arc. Prince. Indiana um, Jones and the Lost Ark. The Last Ark. Lost? Last. The last. It's Lost Ark. I think it's Lost. Because it's Last lost. implies like there's more. Yeah. Well, anyways, lost for 3,000 years. I know so much of that movie from Hollywood Studios. This movie is three hours and three Do minutes. you think I've seen it? Okay, so my dad and actually my sister are big Indiana Jones fans, Jenna and my dad. Um, but I don't think I ever like sat and watched it. So we watched that. We're going to watch the other two. Definitely haven't seen those. Um, that's what we've been doing. <laughs> Can someone please hire me? I'm going to quit my job. Side note. Um... And I think we're going to watch Avengers Endgame. <laughs> what? It's funny that we still haven't finished this Marvel series. So, 
<laughs> if you've been with of us quarantine. all of quarantine, we watched every single Marvel movie except for Endgame. There's probably people out there who have done this thrice <laughs> in the same amount of time. Um, so it's 8.30. We're like, should we keep watching Indiana Jones? Or should we just watch this so we can finally be done? <laughs> I think we'll finally be done. And then maybe that'll be like good vibes like the virus like some say will magically disappear <laughs> <laughs> um and that'll be like the end of needing to so do you realize james to... is going to be here so soon i do two months next month now we can say next oh month oh my gosh it's next month we yeah. woke up the pup amy could you look any sleepier you're so cute what are you sniffing out there's no candy there's no treats. Okay, you just rest. Someone once told me to have no regrets. And I will tell you. <laughs> I had like 10. Sarah hates candy corn. I don't really hate it. I like it more this year than I ever had before. This thing was full like 36 hours ago. To the brim. And it gets empty. Candy corn thief must have came through. Tonight. It's too early for candy cane. It's not really Halloween season until HHN starts. <gasps> so we might as well wait until next year to have Halloween. What? 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 We've picked um, James's Halloween costume. We d You did? What did? What is? You know it. Oh wait, is it Oogie Boogie? No. Oh, I tell ya, I forgot how good that movie hits you in the feels at the end there. Um, it is a little late, past 12. Sarah did fall asleep. Eve, awake. you're awake now that I turn the lights on. I only slept for like the last 30, 45 minutes? minutes? No. Yeah. No. Yeah. No. Totally. Best 30 minutes of the whole movie. No. <laughs> so. That was our evening. Um, is tomorrow Wednesday? Yeah. My work week has been absolutely absurd, so that's cool that tomorrow's Wednesday. So maybe we'll stretch the old legs tomorrow. We'll see how she feels. Um, it's it's getting it's getting real real up here that James is going to be here so soon, and that's very very exciting. Look at this little dude. And be here before we know it. And life will never be the same for us, for sure. And for any of you who are sticking out with us. The vlogs will never be the same either. In the best way. Uh-oh, new month. You guys remember when we were in Chicago and I was reading the last month. The previous month over and over again. Ooh, I can't do this one-handed. Or maybe I can. Multitasking. At its finest. September! So you get two messages now. Alright, so the monthly messages by Mother Teresa. Life is an opportunity, benefit from it. Life is a beauty, admire it. Life is a dream, realize it. Life is a challenge, meet it. Life is a duty, complete it. Life is a game, play it. Life is a promise, fulfill it. Life is sorrow, overcome it. Key that one there. Life is a song, sing it also key. Life is, ex it, life is a struggle, accept it. Life is a tragedy, confront it. Life is an adventure, dare it. Life is luck, make it. Life is life, fight for it. That last one there is key. Life is life, fight for it. And the message of today is a short one by Park Benjamin. Beauty and grace command the world. Guess who put the trick or treats on up the other day? I did. I've been hanging stuff like crazy. Yeah. Two things in James' rooms, one thing in this room, three things in the living room. Look at that. It's good to be home. It's good to be home. Our goals are, we know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, 
It's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.